Hey guys, fall is finally here. Dallas weather is finally cooling down, so it feels more like fall now. So I'm super excited to do a collab with Etted House for a fall makeup look using their newly launched Any Cushion Cream Filter. So let's start. So in Korea, this is called the morning kwan cushion, which means the makeup looks glowy and fresh as in the morning after a good long sleep. And I did try three out of the five shades, vanilla, petal, and beige. And beige fits me the best. It's like a shade 21 with yellow undertone, and petal is like a shade 21 with pink undertone. So just applying a thin layer with the puff for a light to medium coverage. This cushion also has like a net filter, so the powder comes out evenly onto the puff. That's dewy finish, so it looks great with strobing products. On areas that I need more coverage, I'm using this brush that's made for the cushion to just dab some of the products onto the spot. And even after long hours, my face doesn't look cakey, so it still looks good whenever I touch up during the day with this. Moving on to concealer, click, and then the product comes out. Just dabbing some onto my dark circles, and I like to blend it out gently with my ring finger. Dab, dab, dab. Brow time. Filling in my brows with a brown brow pencil. I like to start from the middle and then blend the front. Moving on to eyes, I'm using this matte medium brown stick shadow and applying it onto my crease. Then just blending it out with my finger and then blending it upward. Applying a little bit more on the corners and also along the lower lash line. And then I also want to blend it out smoothly. Applying a light copper brown shade right on top of the crease. And then using a light sand shade. I'm going to use this as a transition color. And then I'm also going to apply that on the lower lash line along the corners. Using a matte color, ivory shade, I'm going to highlight my brow bone. Time to line my eyes. Using a brown gel liner and then winging it out. Also the inner corners with whatever stuff on the brush. Curling my lashes. Adding a coat of mascara to the top and bottom. I decided to apply a dark purple shade on the outer corners, like right along the eyeliner and then on the lower ends as well, just makes my eye makeup pop a little bit more. For the blush, I'm applying this cream stick onto the apples with this brush and then applying some bronzer for a warm fall look. Also using the highlighter from the same palette. Here, nose bridge. Last, I'm applying this rose beige shade, which I think is perfect for the fall time. It's also perfect for like an everyday lipstick. So here's the final look. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.